Prince Harry had a good time on Thursday night's episode of The Late Late Show with James Corden. After sharing tea on an open-topped double-decker bus, the two real-life friends stopped off at the original home used in the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. And in keeping with Corden's usual carpool karaoke-style skits, he asked Harry to rap a bit. This is a story all about how my life got flipped and upside down. Harry and James then knocked on the homeowner's door, where James urged Harry to purchase the home. Harry then asked to use the bathroom because he was, quote, dying for a pee. After his toilet break, James and Harry FaceTimed Harry's wife, Meghan Markle, to see what she thinks about buying the famous house. You'd be the fresh princess of Bel Air. Well, of course, he dragged his heels. He's already used the bathroom. That's how a homie feels. <laughs> Here's what I'll do. I'll put you in touch with the owners. You guys can thrash it out. There's no doubt in my mind that this is where you should be, OK? OK. Has, how's your tour ballet going? Has? I didn't know what you were calling you has now. No, you're not my wife, so. During the segment, Harry also revealed when he knew Meghan was the one. He admitted that it was the couple's second date that he started thinking, wow, this is pretty special. The fact the way that we, we hit it off with each other and we were just so comfortable in each other's company. He also gave insight into his new life in California and spoke out about his and Meghan's decision to leave the UK. It was a really difficult environment, as I think a lot of people saw. We all know what the British press can be like and it was destroying my mental health. I was really? like, this is toxic. Yeah. So I did what any husband and what any father would do, is like, I need to get my family out of here. But we never walked away. And as far as I'm concerned, whatever decisions are made on that side, I will never walk away. Harry added that his life is public service and that wherever he is in the world, it's going to be the same thing. Harry's segment with James was taped on February 5th, just weeks before Buckingham Palace confirmed Meghan and Harry would be officially stepping down from their royal duties.